Alright, hey YouTube, today I'm going to be showing you a Sony Vegas effect, the flying effect. It's pretty simple and easy, and it looks pretty cool. So, to start off, your video should be simply start off with the background, camera not shaking, and just walk in. <laughs> then jump, walk out of the scene. Alright, so, what you want, you want to do is go to the beginning of the clip where the background is, where it's not shaking. If you have a tripod, it would probably be easier. But, um, so, about right there. Save, snapshot to file. Name it background or whatever you really want. Save, yes. And it'll pop up there. Alright, so now I, you could, um, kind of just get rid of the beginning of the clip and Alright, so it's not as long, shorter, and gets to the point faster where you're walking. Now, what you want to do is wait till you jump, and once you get to the highest point of when you're in the air, so about right there, save another snapshot to file and name that body. Save, yes. Now, Click on this and move it back one frame. All right, now click the clip. Put the body image right there. Close it back up. Well, actually, you could keep that one a little farther. It doesn't matter. But now it'll look like this. You'll stop in the air. It looks pretty cool. Kind of stupid, but yeah. All right, now click on this little square it says event pan crop when you go over it make sure it's on the body picture all right now go to check mask make sure the anchor creation tool is highlighted or clicked on now just pretty much draw your body with this thing of create lines um if you want your video to be more effective take like your time on it but since I don't have that much time, I'm just going to rush. Um, so, yeah. Alright. So that looks pretty stupid. And now this is where your background shot comes in. Put that right there for Delete that. Alright, let's put that. Now put it the background picture under the body picture. So now it looks like that. It still looks the same, except the shadow probably moves. It's another thing. You don't want, like, a tree shadow because it moves like that. But, um... Um, that looks... Alright. Now go to the body again. And go back to the event pan crop. Click on position. Actually, to make the... Make it a little better, go to... Feather type. Both and um put at five all right now go to position and from the style clip drag the time thing to about uh, a second in or so now take this big circle thing drag it down and it'll look like you're flying somewhat all right so It'll look like this. Uh, you walk in. You look up. You jump and you fly. It's going kind of slow, so you just take the these diamond keyframes and drag them closer together. So now it'll be a little faster. But still. Maybe, maybe make it a little faster so alright that looks pretty good but I'm just going to make it one slot faster it's really up to you too I mean if you're going to make like the flying go slower like you're not going to go fast change the um the blur to like less and if you're going to go faster make the blur more up to you so 
now let's see what it looks like. This is the video. Look up, jump. Alright. Make this maybe a little smaller. Delete this video. This is where you land. Delete that. And yeah, so here's the video. Walk in. Jump. And then background. You can make this shorter also. I mean, it's up to you. And if you're asking why does it look so shitty, like why can I still see the background kind of when I'm in the air? That's because the masking was done, which you can see the grass right there. If you take your time doing the mask, it'll look a lot better. So, um, thanks for watching. Maybe this helped a little bit, maybe it didn't. Um, please comment what you think and subscribe. Thanks.